to at bbc.co.uk. Right, our final couple this evening have consistently been at the top end of the leaderboard. They gave us figure rates, cucarachas and passion on Saturday. Here's a reminder of JB and Amy's sultry rumba. I was into it, I was enjoying your performance. Your wife gave you freedom to give passion, then you gave passion. I want to see more momentum, a bit more freedom, because you're a good dancer. I felt there wasn't enough connection. But you know what? This is a really difficult dance, and you did it justice. JB, we know that you wanted it to be a sultry rumba. How much do you think you pulled it off? I mean, I'm getting quite hard watching it back, to be honest. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Um, do you know what? It, it, it felt like I delivered on the assignment. Yeah, I think you understood it. <laughs> you understood yeah. the assignment. And it, yeah. it, to, to dance as well, it felt really, really good. I feel like, you know, the start of the night, Amy was just saying, just be in the moment. Literally, we're just going to do exactly what we did in the training room. Um, towards the end of the week, we felt like it really clicked. Um, and that was all we wanted to do, go out there and perform to the best of our ability, as we have done every week, yeah. um, and really deliver on the rumba, what the rumba should be, the yes. essence of the rumba. And we love seeing in your VT that your wife, Chloe, came and gave you some tips and training. Yes. How much did it help getting her approval to be sensual <laughs> with your partner? Well, I mean, I, I can't even say it was approval. She was literally just like, you need to do this. <laughs> yeah. This yeah. is what it's supposed to be, so do it, OK? Um, but, yeah, I mean, obviously, I think the biggest thing for everybody who's involved in the competition is support, you know? Yeah. You want to have support from your loved ones, from your family. Yeah. Um, and, and for something so, you know, it is a more intimate dance. In yeah. fact, probably the most intimate dance. So, you know, that, I think, psychologically has its own sort of, you know, inhibitions and things mm. like that, of course. You know, I'm a married man and I take that very seriously. So, you know, I wanted to make sure that first I did the dance, dance justice, but also did the family proud. Yeah, I loved it. Yeah. Chloe was just like, sah! Yeah. Go for it, Amy. <laughs> I loved it. And Amy, you joined Strictly in 2017. I can't believe this was your first ever rumba I with know. a partner. How special was that moment for you? Oh, I loved it. And rumba's my favourite Latin dance. Um, and I've got so much respect to the judges, but I've got to disagree with Craig. Oh on the, there wasn't enough connection. My husband, um, lovely Ben, was <laughs> sat at home and was like, she danced that with JB as though she was dancing it with me. He's a dancer himself. Uh, and yeah, we felt really connected. Absolutely, so yeah. for the first time, I'm gonna disagree with you there, Craig. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. Well, do you know what? Your face said it all, JB. Do you mean yeah. Craig's feedback? <laughs> no, uh, I don't. Let's take a look. <laughs> I felt like he got stuck in a few places, particularly when you put your leg behind your back. There wasn't enough connection between you also. I thought that could have been improved. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, you're like scratching your like, really? Literally, <laughs> and there was a point where we're like this. Snap. Like, we couldn't have been more connected. I was honestly. That, <laughs> How surprised were you to hear that? Well, that I think it was the shock, because I was like, how could I be more connected than I was? <laughs> I mean, even Chloe came, you know, when I got home, Chloe was just like, no, I definitely felt like there was a connection. At one point, I thought you were kissing. I was like, no, 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 I wasn't kissing. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> but no, she, as, as you know, you know, she was, she was very, very supportive. Well, you've made it through to week five. Yes. And you'll be doing a jive to this. One, two, three, go. Oh, what a tune. Outcast, hey, yeah. Love it. The jive will really test JB's stamina, Amy. So yes. what are you going to do differently in training to help JB with this? Do you know what? We So far, it's going really well. We've got the steps down. But for me now, it's obviously, like we do any other week, it's all about understanding the fundamentals, the technique. Because if you're doing it properly, you breathe correctly, yeah. you, your energy is going in the right places. And for me, it's always making sure when you dance it, you don't mark it, and we never mark it. Oh, so you're going full out every time. Yeah, for me, why would you mark it? That's just personally me, mm. and the way I've always taught, the way I teach my students, the way my husband and I always dance, and the way we have always since yeah. day one. Because, you know, going through it half-heartedly, for me, you're practicing bad habits. So mm. when we dance, we always 
We always commit, don't we? Don't I know it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm feeling the commitment. Sorry. She was like, she's like, no, 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 that is... No, you've got that. Let's take it to another level now. Ooh, I like it. <laughs> well, we've been asking everyone for their comments and questions. Ooh. So we've had this from Millie, who's in South Wales. How different is the choreography from Strictly compared to the JLS concerts? Thanks, Millie. Oh, I mean, it's, it's like night and day. <laughs> uh, I remember sort of week one, we were doing the waltz and Amy just said, like, if you're going to do something, you can't be bouncing up and down. It's elegant. You've got to have... You know, imagine there's something on your head oh. and you cannot drop it. You know, and then we were doing a cha-cha and, again, I was trying to, like, get all my groove into it and she's just like, no, 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 no. Down below the waist, that does all the work. Above the waist needs to be up. You have to posture. So I think that's one of, one of the challenging things, like, maintaining posture. Because whenever I do stuff with JLS, it's just big. You know, and the bigger it is, the better it is. Yeah. And, of course, we do have to be clean because it's, you know, there's four of us and you can tell if someone's got an arm out of place. Or, but actually, generally speaking, it's kind of, you know, the bigger you are, the better it is. And it doesn't matter too much if it's a little bit... Messy. Where Borum and Latin is the opposite. Do you yeah. know what I mean? It's all internalised. Yeah. It's all technical. Synchronised. You've got to like unlearn place. everything you know. Yeah. Do you know um, what though? It's lovely watching you both because it seems like a really caring partnership. How important mm. do you think that is to your success in the competition? I oh, think it's everything. Yeah. It's massive. Yeah. You, we we walk into rehearsals with the biggest smile. We want to be there. We're having fun, and I think that then comes through onto the dance floor. But most importantly, is why. I believe you've been so consistent as well, because if you're enjoying it, yeah. you want to continue to learn, you care about it. And yeah, we just literally, we're like best friends hanging out every day, aren't we? Yeah, and that's yeah. what it should be. Like for me, you know, it's about having the support for each other, because when you go onto that dance floor, it is just the two of you. You know, and, and everything goes on that dance floor. Good, bad, ugly, everything in between. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And, and so, obviously, we always want to put our best foot forward. Um, but regardless of, as I say, whether it goes to plan or doesn't go to plan, you just, you know, you're together on the dance floor and that's where you leave everything. Good luck, you two, for the weekend. We'll be watching. It's JV and Amy. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that's it for tonight. Thanks to all my guests. Jeanette's back tomorrow with another bumper show. Plus, we'll be heading off to the training rooms for the first time this week to see how some of the couples are coping with their upcoming dances. That's from 6.30. Good night.